I'm Dr. Spencer Russell. And I'm Dr. Alex McCree. And we're here with Jack's Implants and Dentures to talk to you about the All On Four Dental Procedure. What it is, what it costs, what it entails, and just more information about this specific procedure. We have went an in-depth video before to talk about all the different types of full mouth implants, but now we're gonna talk about just the All On Four. It goes through a few different names. Uh, it could be Teeth in a Day, Teeth Tomorrow, um, All On Four, All On Six. There's a bunch of different names, but basically all it's coming down to is the All On Four. Uh, and that's what it started out as. That's the most common name. Uh, so that's what you'll see marketed here and there. But really what that re uh, revolves around is four implants that are placed all across and a bridge that's made together so that way you can function in group. Um, sometimes you do six implants. That's what it means All On Six. Sometimes you use four, all on four, all on five, et cetera. Um, but that's what the basic function is, and that's what you're gonna get. Um, Dr. Russell here kind of explain what it is and then what actually function that gives you. Yeah, so essentially when we're talking about all on four, fixed hybrid, whatever it is, it is just a bridge that goes on top of these implants. It screws into them, so the really nice thing about this versus a traditional tooth bridge or anything like that is it is removable for cleaning, and then you can screw it right back into place. Um, so, and those are immediate, correct? Yes, okay. yeah, yeah. So after the procedure, you're gonna get something right away. You're gonna have teeth. You're never gonna be going in a denture or anything like that, at least here at Jack's Implant. Yep. Um, so tell us a little bit more about this, Dr. McCree. When do you decide, are you gonna do four? What are you gonna do six? What, what's the difference here? Because a lot of people will say, well, if you're gonna do a four or six, well, give me six. I want, I want as many as I can get. Yep. So uh, there's really, as far as the teeth go, there's not a really a difference between four or six implants. Uh, there is no real variation on what you're gonna get. So for this you know, example, there's six. Uh, for this example, there's four. Uh, four this here. one was another one that's six. It really depends on what your bone allows. Uh, you don't want to squeeze six in a spot that should be four. Uh, early on in my career, I did that a, you know, a little bit more, um, but it's just not as cleansable. It's not going to give you any more chewing power. It's not going to make the teeth look any better. It's not going to function any better. So there's really no reason to do anything more than four, unless there's just more space for it. And you, yeah, you might as well in that case. Uh, but here, we don't really charge by the implant. It's more just the actual case fee. So that way, we're just going to do whatever we think is best for that individual patient. Um, now, as far as you know, what the patient feels. Um, you know, we're saying, hey, you get implants, but patients don't want implants, right? They want teeth. Um, what would be the look and feel? You know, what can you eat with these types of things? Like, what would be something, you know, that you would want to tell people what you're going to get? Yeah, so essentially right after surgery, you're still going to get a set of teeth. Now, we put you in a temporary set here most of the time. Um, of course, that is patient dependent, but whenever you get your teeth, you're able to eat straight away. Now, we do go over a specific soft diet with you um, because as those implants are healing, it's just like if you were to have an injury, you strain a muscle or anything like that, you've got to let things heal. You've got to let those implants heal and then the bone fuse to them to give them their final strength. So during that healing period, you're just taking it a little easy. So when we say soft foods, we're talking about if you can cut it with the side of a cheap plastic fork, then you can eat it. So a lot of people, when they, when they think soft diet, they're thinking, oh, I'm eating mashed potatoes for three months. That's not the case. So a lot of stuff you eat in the crock pot, baked fish, lasagna, lasagna, a lot of that stuff is good, but things like eating a steak, beef jerky, biting into nuts, rock candy, stuff like that, you are gonna have to avoid those for a few months just while the implants heal. Once the implants are done healing though, you can eat anything you want. We've had patients here biting in two crab claws. I don't recommend that because she had regular teeth on the bottom and I don't know if those will ha handle it, but the bridge itself can take it. You can eat anything you want once you get that final permanent set of teeth. And what about the aesthetics? I, I get this question quite a bit. Um, it says, you know, hey, I'm kind of scared about losing my natural teeth or, you know, I'm in a denture, but are these gonna look natural? I know some friends that got them and they don't look good. They're very opaque. They don't look lifelike. Um, explain to you know a couple different uh, materials, I guess titanium and zirconia, and yep. like how do they get, how do they know that's going to look lifelike? Yeah, so a lot of that comes down to what we do in our lab in house. So we're going to sit there and go through everything as far as a smile design. We're going to take your pictures. We're going to take 3D scans. We're going to combine all of that. So that way I can design a smile that fits your face. I'm not going to be putting in teeth that are too big, too small, anything like that, because I'm able to see how that smile is going to look before we even put anything into your mouth. From there, it all comes down to our hand finishing work. So we spend countless hours 
finishing every single bridge. We're putting that detail in between the teeth, putting that staining, the characterization, everything to give it that lifelike translucency, the transition of the colors, and then that really nice pink color that's gonna match your gum specifically. Um, so really going into the different materials, we offer a couple of different materials here. The vast majority of what we do is monolithic zirconia. So this is all one piece bridge of a very, very strong, the strongest ceramic you can get, which is zirconia. Um, so with this, this is gonna be as strong as you need for 99% of people. Yep. Um, I mean, who, how often do we see somebody that needs more than this? Uh, very, 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 very rare. Uh, and we don't try to change that you know, to somebody who doesn't need it. It's just not necessary and there's no need to have to do that. Uh, but in those specific in situations, uh, maybe you're you know, an absolute linebacker. You, know, you have the strongest jaw imaginable. We do actually offer titanium uh, models as well. That actually has a zirconia uh, overlay or sleeve um, or sometimes individual teeth as well. Uh, but it does have a titanium backing uh, just for that added strength and support for someone who needs it. It's extremely rare, uh, but we do offer that um, you know, at, at our office. And you know, if it's needed, we absolutely do that. But um, typically, yes, at 99%, not needed. Um, so that's kind of a quick and dirty uh, rundown of what it is, what are the names, um, but also the all important thing is how much does it cost and you know what is included with that. At our specific office, uh, we're usually about seventeen to nineteen thousand dollars per arch. Uh, that is all included. Uh, that means a top or a bottom. Uh, so somewhere between uh, thirty-four to thirty-seven for an upper and lower, at least at this time. Uh, while we always have updated pricing and, and um, information on our website at jacksimplant.com, but right now uh, that's you know that's what we're going with. National average is around twenty-two to twenty-five per arch. Uh, so you may see uh, in your specific city that's what you see, you see a lot. Um, you know we have on-site lab. Everything is done in-house, so there's a lot of savings in that. Um, so that's what we're at. But you know a lot of people want to know, hey. What does it cost and, and, and what all is included in that? And what's included in that is everything. You know, that's a, a you know, warranty, all the extractions, if you have any, uh, any additional grafting, if you need any, uh, four to six implants, and the temp or the final or everything in between. Um, and there's also a few different changes if you were to say you want the temp and you want it to look a little wider or a little uh, bigger teeth or whatever fits for you. But basically that's everything included. So that way it's very, very seamless. You don't have to worry about being you know, piecemeal and there's codes everywhere and you don't really understand what's going on and what you're gonna get here. You know exactly what you're gonna get. We try to be extremely transparent. And that's why we list everything upfront and honest. Uh, that's because that's the way we were kind of raised. Uh, it's just very straightforward and very, very easy. Um, yeah. And so we'll put a link right in the description of the video below. So that'll take you straight to the pricing page. Cause like I said, it changes a little bit over time. So if you go to that link, it'll take you straight to our prices and it's gonna be the transparent upfront pricing for you. We'll also put a link in there to our before and afters. Yep. Cause that's really important to people. Like you said, you wanna see something that's gonna fit your smile, that looks natural. So look at all those. We put as much of our work up there as we can. So that way you can hopefully find something that looks kind of similar to you so you can get an idea of what it's going to look like for you. And then lastly, uh, we also service, of course, we're in Jacksonville, Florida, um, but we also service people from across the nation. So you also see a link in there as well about how we have people actually flying in from across the country uh, to come see us if that's something that ends up being working out for you. Um, so again, I'm Dr. Alex McCree. And I'm Dr. Spencer Russell. And this is uh, the basically quick and dirty about all in forward dental procedure. Uh, and we're at Jackson Implants. Thanks for coming to watch.